I'm going to ask that you watch a film called The Pirate Bay Away from the Keyboard. It's pretty long. There's subtitles. There's a lot of uh, Swedish uh, being spoken. Um, so, you know, you got to read a little bit. Um, the guys are freaking annoying, obnoxious. You kind of want to punch them in the face. Um, but <laughs> with all that said, uh, I know I really, I really hyped you up to watch the movie. I think it's important. I think it's important for you to just see, you know, it focuses on one of the many Pirate Bay trials that they have, but I want you to just focus on and see like how there's a struggle here. There's a struggle for access. There's a struggle for rights. There's a struggle for free speech. Um, there's a struggle for democracy, however you want to think about it, that you don't see when you sit at home and you torrent something or you, you, you commit a crime, you steal a car, right? You, you don't see all the levels of it. So, you know, if you've used a torrent before or anything like it or benefited from a torrent in any way, I, I think it's good just to see, like, what people are doing, you know, what happens behind the scenes, right? Because it's so easy to just discreetly press download, you know, from home, okay? So we're gonna watch this film, and I have some questions for you. I just want you to think about some of these things as you watch it. I'm not gonna follow up with this. Some of these questions will be on the next test, which is coming up soon. What? Soon, very soon. Um, but anyways, just be familiar with some of the concepts from the film. Think about what are they fighting for? What are they arguing that they're, they're fighting for in this movie? And what are some of the group's beliefs, okay? Also think about who they're fighting against, like who is this battle uh, against, and think about how do they make a profit. I'll tell you, but just pay attention. It's through advertising, primarily uh, adult film porno ads. Um, that, so, they, so just think about that. So they, they use the same sort of model as like a TV news or radio or whatever. Um, so that's how, they turn, that's how they turn a profit, but it's debatable how much profit they turn. Um, how is the Pirate Bay being attached to the Pirate Party, which has um, a couple seats in the EU Parliament? Par par <laughs> parliament. Um, having them host its website, what value is that? So the Pirate Party, in some countries in Europe, um, they have different democratic systems where um, you, know, you could have 10 parties, you know, like our equivalent of Congress members, right? Or Senate members. And you could have not just Democrat and Republican, but you could have, you know, Green Party, Libertarian or whatever. And the percentage of votes that your party gets in an election, that's how many seats they get. Um, so, it, so the Pirate Party, which you'll see, had seats in uh, the EU Parliament. So what does it mean if you censor the Pirate Bay, you're essentially censoring a political party, which you, you, you cannot do in any democratic uh, country, okay? Um, think about how free speech and democracy are forms of Pirate Bay. Just think about all the content that cannot be distributed through other more mainstream channels that can be distributed through the Pirate Bay. And what does that mean? So how, in, in some ways, are they guardians of free speech by distributing stuff like WikiLinks or WikiLeaks or any, anything like that? Regardless of what you think of WikiLeaks, just think, think about like content like that. Um, yeah, so think about how they, they think their service encourages free speech. And think about what the professor has to say about copyright and economic incentive. He has a little thing to say, and just pay attention to what he says about, you know, copyright's supposed to encourage creativity. Um, what does the Pirate Bay mean when it says it's a contact service? You want to pay attention to this discussion in the film, but basically what it means is they don't actually provide any content. They provide a place where people can come together and do stuff, communicate. In this instance, these people are uploading torrent files, not actual movies or music, but torrent files. So the Pirate Bay is actually protected by Safe Harbor in this instance. So what does it mean for them to be a contact service? Okay. Yeah, the site is an empty page created by the users. We don't interfere with the contact. Uh, the content, it's a contact service. So just think about what that means. All right, press play on this film, enjoy it, watch it with the family, try to struggle through it or whatever, whatever it is. I, th I think it's a good film. I think it puts 
all of our unauthorized uses in context. I think it's a valuable thing for us to consume. Um, but that's it. You've made it through week six. We only got a few more weeks left. Okay, but we got our next exam coming up real, real soon. So I'll get that um, study guide up and popping real soon and be, be on point for all that. And it will be the same vibe as the first exam, which y'all did absolutely fabulous on. It's really good. I'm really, pr really proud of you. <laughs> you got my heart pounding. All right. Take care, y'all. Uh, it's the real Dr. Dre. I'm out. Peace.